Murray has retained his starting position and there's been a lot of speculation about the nines position mm. with people like John Cooney, Kieran Marmy, and Luke McGrath. Yeah. So as a master at nine, master. Yeah, what, would, what do you make of it all what's going on at the nine position in Ireland? Look, it's, it's, it's great, first of all, to have competition for places and that's what you, know, you need to develop a squad and, and to be a successful squad. And I think, yeah, there's look, lots of chat. And in terms of John, look, you know as well, you've been watching as well, how good he's yeah. been in the last the last six months, you know, with Ulster and performing really, really well. And yeah. I don't think we've seen Connor at his best for probably 12 or 18 months. And I think, you know, I think both players would actually benefit, I, I feel, if John got an opportunity to start a game with the Six Nations. And it might sound strange, but, it, you know, from my past experience, Connor's been in a position for the last eight years, starting the big games, yeah. a starter for Ireland in all these games. And that brings its own pressure. And I think you, you see John, and I bring it back to myself, in 2009, I was on the bench. I was second choice kind of all season. I sat on the bench for the first three games. We won all three games. And I was selected to play against Scotland in that fourth game, that Grand Slam year. Yeah. I played in the game. I got man of the match and not being big headed about it, but it was, a, it was an opportunity for me to stake a claim and, and, and I was eager to play. And I was on the bench again the following week in the Welsh game, but it gave me the confidence that when I came off the bench, yeah. I knew I could do it. And I think with the same would be for John. If he got an opportunity to start in a Six Nations, yeah. that would, that, you know, Andy has obviously picked him in the squad and it's, you know, you put your faith in these players, give them the experience. And no one's saying Connor isn't going to play for Ireland again. But I think it would be, it would be great for the two lads, yeah. personally, to, to see them develop. And Connor might kind of get a bit of a, you know, a kick that he needs. Um, who knows what he needs? I had it a few years ago as well. Yeah. Everyone, everyone gets it in their career. Um, Peter's no longer allowed to go back to Munster tonight. That's it. That's what he said. It's like, what have you no, done? I've massive respect for Connor and what he's done. Like, world class, you know, for the last number of years, he's been, you know, one of the best in the world. Yeah. But I yeah. think there's a time in everyone's career that, you know, someone else comes along yeah. But this, you know, Connor will step up to this challenge, I've no doubt, and you know he's going to be a better player as a result it's of it. It's healthy competition. Absolutely, that's yeah, what you need. Yeah.